The Civil War Battle of Gettysburg was a three-day fight from July the 1st to July the 3rd, 1863. It occurred in the countryside and farmland near the town of Gettysburg, covering 40 miles. General Robert E. Lee was on his way to bring the war to the north, taking the pressure off Virginia in areas where his soldiers could live off the land, perhaps forcing a settlement letting the South become its own country. According to legend, the Confederate troops needed boots. Conveniently, Gettysburg was known for its tanning industry and its shoes. As it was on the way, General Robert E. Lee marched in and took over the town. He supposedly did this to take the boots for his troops. However, the Union Army caught up with them. Another source said the first stop for Lee was a small village called Cashtown, a village located between Chambersburg and Gettysburg. After learning through a spy that the Union troops led by General George Meade were onto his plans to attack the North at Harrisburg, Lee sent a team to Gettysburg, while preparing to meet the Union troops in battle when they were spotted. This incredibly costly battle put an end to 50,000 men. Because of all the suffering, the Gettysburg National Military Park has many hauntings and entity sightings, even 142 years later. Many soldiers are still on duty or experiencing the terrifying events leading to their deaths. Other hauntings not related to the battle also have been reported in the National Park, because the land's history started long before 1863 and continues until the present. During the filming of the film Gettysburg, actors dressed in uniform would often walk off set, exploring the real battlefields during their downtime. A group of Union soldiers went up to the Little Round Top area to enjoy the sunset. While standing there, they heard the rustling of leaves behind them. Looking to see who it was, you can imagine their surprise when a haggard-looking old man dressed as a Union private made his appearance. The man was filthy and smelled of sulfur, a key ingredient of the black powder used in 1863. He walked up to the men as he handed them a few musket rounds. He said, rough one today, eh boys? He turned and walked away. As the startled men examined these musket rounds, the mystery man vanished into thin air. They brought these musket rounds into the town of Gettysburg, which were authenticated as original rounds 130 years old. This photo was captured in the park. There isn't much information about the photo, but it allegedly shows an apparition. But what do you think it is? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.